when you gaze into a mirror and you see things have changed, you don't think the mirror is the reason for the change, right? You understand that you have changed in whatever way. You know, when you're, when you're looking in the mirror and you're putting on your makeup and you see that change, you understand you did that, right? And you put your hair up or if you're a guy, whatever, you know, you're shaved in one minute, you're all scruffy and the next minute your skin's all smooth. You understand it had nothing to do with the mirror. It's you that changed. So it's, there's no difference when we're talking about the world around you, which can only reflect you. Nothing in your world changes. Only you shift states, you change, and it reflects that. And the coolest thing is you are doing this billions of times per second. So you know, you're watching a sunrise and you're like, oh, I got to run and get my camera. And so that I can take a picture of this. So you run and get your camera. And by the time you get back, it's shifted. The, the, the sun didn't move in the sky. It's simply reflecting a change within you. One minute you're in one state of mind that allows this sun to arise and be beautiful and gorgeous just for you, babes. You did that. And then in the next minute, you're in a state of whatever, which is, oh my God, oh my God, I've got to take a picture of this and show it to the whole world and and make people go, wow. And and that's a whole different state than the state you were in a moment before that. And the sunrise reflects that. All of a sudden, it's gone. Now, that's a huge aha right there. (laughs) <laughs> there should be an enormous aha for you within that. There should be enormous, oh. Because one minute when you weren't thinking about it and you weren't trying and you weren't putting any effort into it, you had a delight. You had a surprise, this is just for you. And then in the next moment, you're in a state of lack of, oh my God, I need this, I need to do this. If you didn't already have the phone in your hand, let it go. Let it go. You don't need to run and miss out on this, this gift you were given. You know, it's, it's a, instead what I would do and what I do is I'm just like, wow, thank you. If I was meant to take a picture of it, I would have had my, my phone already in my hand. If I don't have my phone in my hand in that moment, it's like, okay, this is just for me. Thank you. So let's go deeper into this let's say you're out for a walk and a breeze just like blows your hat off or whatever. Okay. It's reflecting a change within you. One minute there's a breeze, one minute there's not. It's all reflecting changes in you, not changes that you need to sit there and analyze and go, Oh my God. It's just, it's, you know, something for you to go, Oh, isn't that interesting? When a construction company in your town is suddenly building a new housing track or, or a new house or this or that, it's reflecting big changes building within you. It's all about you. One minute there was nothing there. Now there's a, somebody's building a house. It's not right or wrong or good or bad. It's just a reflection of, oh, huh, isn't that interesting? Take a moment to truly kind of look about you, look around and see what's different now than a moment or two ago. Maybe the water in your glass is lower or you're reading a different or hearing a different sentence than the sentence I was saying a minute ago. Um, maybe your cat is, has gotten up and moved over and now it's sleeping next to you compared to where it was a minute ago. Uh, a picture on the wall is slightly askew. Um, you're my daughter-in-law loves to dye her hair. You know, one minute her hair's one color, one minute her hair's another color. Uh, There's some new information about the government passing a new bill or this or that. Or an old friend is now getting married. They were single one moment, now they're married. Um, You move into a new town. That was a big one for me. Moving into a new town. 
and on and on and on. These are all simply reflections of changes in you. And like I said, it can be as minor as the water in your cup is now lower than it was a minute ago. That's you. That's changes in you. All it's doing is showing you that you are shifting. It doesn't, there's not a, there doesn't have to be some big hidden meaning behind it. It's just evidence of the amazing, fantastic shifter you are. You are constantly shifting from one state to another without trying, without effort. And it's all proof of your life constantly moving, moving, moving without any effort from your part. So of course, in this picture is my little munchkin, my grandson. I wanted a grandson for so long. And, you know, there was a time when he was just tiny like that. And now he's, you know, <laughs> it's a lot of change. Yes, his hands are that big. He has enormous hands. He gets that from his daddy. Um, and, you know, so I look at him. Yeah. How many times have you come across a kid and you're like, oh my God, last time I saw you, you were only this and now you're this. Holy cow. How'd you grow so much? I didn't change. <laughs> how many people say that? I'm probably the queen of saying that. How did you change? I didn't change. Well, that's the biggest false sentence there is. The only reason this little being has shifted and changed is because they're reflecting the changes in you. When you understand this, you'll realize that every breath in and every breath out, you're in ever constant change and evolution and expansion. You don't stop. You guys hear me say this all the time. So you know, when in our mind, we have a manifestation we want to create. And in our mind, that manifestation, we get that car, we get that job, we get that significant other, we get that billion dollars, whatever. In our mind, that's it. That's the end of the story. Close the book. But in real life, that's not the way it happens. You get that job. And then you're on to the next thing. And so hence, we're like, oh, I didn't even realize I got what I wanted. And I covered this in a, one of my podcasts recently. I talked about how we just blast right past our manifestations. That is why we, we, we have this image in our mind that we're supposed to be this magic, magic, you know, wonderful God. And I'm not because my manifestations aren't coming true. And I'm always like, are you sure? <laughs> are you sure your manifestations aren't coming true? Because uh, look around, look around, look at where you are, look at what you've created in your entire freaking life. Zoom out away from your lifeline and take a look at all you have done and shifted and created and changed. Is your life, is, is, is the sun at a different spot in the sky than it was when we started this video? Yes. So how much have you changed in just this video? <laughs> a lot. Don't worry what these changes mean. Just, just see them. Jacuzzi into them. Celebrate them. And in that, you get to feel the immense <laughs> magic. And holy shit. Wow. Wonder within these constant reflections of the amazing, immense magic and wonder that is you. Got it? Oh, uh, look at it. One more amazing video you just manifested, you just created. Damn, you're on fire. <laughs>